Careless Whisper by, why can't I think of who it's by? Who's Careless Whisper by? <laughs> that one, I know who it's by, it's, I can't remember his name. George Michael? So, Careless Whisper by George Michael. <laughs> I heard it on the way here from the airport, I was like, like in the back of the car by myself. Drug Lords on Netflix. <laughs> Just learn about the drug lords. I binge watch a lot. Um, right now I'm really into crime documentaries. Coffee milkshake. Which are hard to find. Why doesn't Betty have that one on the show? She's vanilla, I guess. <laughs> but like, she's so much more than that. Maybe she'll drink coffee someday. The chilling thing is, Ethel went through the trouble of bringing that milkshake here from Pops. I mean, how mad is she? You know, the title Serpent Queen was given to her, but she still very much is Betty. You know, she doesn't sit on a throne and wear a leather jacket every day to school. She's still just a, a big ally for the serpents rather than like one of their leaders. There's so much hate and like anger uh, already out there on the internet, so I try to just keep my social media more like positive. But sometimes my anger slips in there and I have to talk about an issue that I'm passionate about. I'm really passionate about body positivity right now because it's even just something that I'm still trying to discover on my own. Like being okay with my body at whatever weight that it is and feeling confident and beautiful. I don't. Photoshop any photos that I post of myself. I really just can't stand the people that do because this is why things are an issue. Like you're adding to the problem of young girls thinking that they need to be this thin and have like the perfect contour and the big <laughs> lips. It's like the women and guys that you see on Instagram with a hundred something million followers a lot of those people do look like that. They have those amazing picture perfect bodies, but those perfect people are only like 0.01% of the population. So you're just being force fed this image and being told that it's beautiful and perfect. And you, you believe it because that's all you see. Not everyone looks like that. Most people don't. It's just the image that is being thrown at people right now. I want to just set an example for young men and women to just don't put so much pressure on yourself and your body 